Hey, this is a uh, funny way to start a vlog, but I had to put my warm gloves on before I went outside just at Starbucks. Uh, this is the Bloor Yorkville area, John Thomas. And we're doing the Ice Festival. Hopefully I'm holding this camera right. <laughs> That's our first sculpture. Yep. No. What is that? What is that? It's just a photography. Oh, really? Okay. Okay. Oh, that's cool. Okay. So, I guess that's the sponsor. You know what? The problem is when I hold the phone like this, it's really hard to hold it because I'm used to holding it the other way. But apparently, it looks better on YouTube, even though it's very awkward for me. So, Maybe one day I'll figure this out. So that's probably the sponsor. So this is, well, this is basically just walking around. This is the church, back of the uh, Church of the Redeemer, which I used to come to a lot when I was homeless, and uh, down and out, but those are better now. I shouldn't really say that, eh? Ah, who cares? So, it's my life, right? Okay, so, uh, <clears throat> there's some uh, construction. <laughs> Could be Toronto with their construction, right? So basically, this is uh, Bloor and uh, Avenue Road, uh, what we're looking at, uh, this area. And we're headed to this uh, ice sculpture event, which is being held in Yorkville. And we're coming up to Cumberland. And we'll turn on to Cumberland, see what's going on. So we're just uh, going to look at it. I haven't vlogged in a while, so I thought I'd vlog this. It's uh, Saturday, February 9th. Uh, about 1 p.m., just after 1 p.m., and it's my day off, so let's have some, let's have some fun. <laughs> oh, God, it's cool. Minus six, come on, man. But these gloves are better, right? Eh? They're supposedly touch-sensitive, and they kind of work with this phone, but, oh, well, that's okay. As long as my hands are covered. Uh, let's see, I see some police there, so that could mean there's some, actually I see a crowd in the distance, I see some food trucks, I think, yeah, that's probably it, okay, we're on the right street, okay, here we come, oh yeah, that's definitely the event, I see the fencing. I love this place. They, they give you free coffee here at Espresso. One time I just asked for a sample, and they wound up giving me a whole free uh, sample of cappuccino, which is a pretty good value considering they usually run four bucks, five dollars. I'll probably come back here for that. The only problem is when I do these outside vlogs in the winter, my just hands usually give out after a certain length of time, and I have to put my phone down. So we're going to try and well, let's see where we're at. We're at almost four minutes. <laughs> Last time I did this, I by the 15-minute mark, I just couldn't take it. Oh, this is huge. Cool. Do 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 do. So let's see. I forget the uh, official title, but I believe it's called the Blural. Oh God. I swear I haven't been drinking, but I'm sorry my words. The Bloor Yorkville Ice Carving Festival. There's something similar to that. <laughs> and I see some ice sculptures. <laughs> There's one. Ah. Actually, I guess this is what I'll be tagging. That's the official title. Uh, you gotta be careful I don't slip on some ice because there's ice on the, uh, what do you call it, sidewalk. I don't want to slip on that. It's kind of funny if I wiped out on some ice too. Okay, so there's tickets, so that means there's. Oh, it's free to get in. Let's see what they're saying. Oh, cool. Okay, 
this is a pretty good crowd. Okay. Well, let's watch my step while I try to kill some ice. That's cool. Hopefully people don't mind that I'm filming them. So this is kind of interesting, that they fenced it off, so apparently they don't want people coming in and touching the ice, which I guess makes sense, it's like a bump. See if I can take some pictures. No. That sense of just don't work. Okay. Let's go. So some you can touch and some you can't. There's one you can touch. <laughs> There's me touching it. Those ones there I can't touch. <laughs> okay. In the 88. All right. So I notice all these sculptures are sponsored. It's kind of hard to film when I'm wall to wall with people <laughs> at my back. <laughs> Putting a little space. Yeah. <laughs> it's like free advertising for all these these corporations, eh? <laughs> yeah, let's take it over. Okay. Pressford, okay. <laughs> okay, this vlog is about to be over. This is very corporate. <laughs> okay, there's the whole Red Fruit sculpture. Good afternoon, everybody. For those just joining us, welcome to Ice Fest 19. The 14th annual Ice Fest here. Pretty amazing. In the very cool neighborhood of Yorkville, otherwise known as Hollywood North. Well, our entire city, but here, especially in Yorkville, we celebrate the film industry and our friends who visit us here on an annual basis from Hollywood. That's our theme today at Ice Fest 19, Hollywood North. In case you haven't checked it out, there's, there's Hollywood North themed sculptures made out of ice, of course, on the west side of the park near the big rock. Cool sculptures to check out. Some photo ops. If you're posting anything on social media, Ice Fest. Hashtag Ice Fest 19. There's a competition going on. I hear it's a close one too. On the east side of the park, 12 very talented ice sculptors are carving their masterpieces. And you guys can cast your vote on who you think is the winner. We're going to be announcing the winner right here from the Ice Fest Lounge where the DJ's playing the tunes. Bellow Sound, of course, setting the vibe over the weekend. 
and we're going to be here just after five o'clock. We're going to be announcing the winners of that competition, although they're all very talented. Thanks for being here. February is Heart Month. As always, we have our friends from the Heart and Stroke Foundation. We have a tent right in the middle of the park here. They're all wearing their full cool red tubes with the heart on it. We all have a heart. We all need a strong, healthy, working heart. So, give generously today to the Heart and Stroke Foundation. They're out there with some cylinders. They have some change. We all have some change in the pocket. So, anything that's left over, you can go buy a cocktail. Hot and cold at Sassafras. I hear Sassafras got some great coffee. They can help the DJ out here, keeping us going, keeping us fueled. One cool thing about this this part is uh, this guy's doing all the talking for me, so I don't have to say anything, but we're getting away. And this is all presented by our friends at the Blue York BIA. There's, a, there's a photo op. There. That's amazing. Steven in the house. We see it. Yeah, so this is a movie theme. He's got the Zaza coffee going. Director's chair. Okay. Drop by the Blue York for BIA tent. Okay, so that's the end of this part. Because we've got to get, get a little warm. We'll come back for more of this. Giving away a lot of prizes here at the end of the day. Have so a great day. For Thanks for being here. It's quite loud here. Spending your afternoon in a very cool day.